Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm John. What's going on, everybody? I'm Steve. Yeah, I know you do. It I love it. It wasn't the one I wanted, which we discussed, yeah. but it was the one that needed to get more. <laughs> you did need it, yeah. You know? Because she's the only girl you sent for. <laughs> really, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Especially, the only person. Specifically in all the shows we've watched so yeah. far, yeah. She's the only one I have so far. <laughs> I mean, there's been others in the history of my life. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> but the, on the channel, she's the only one I've been simping for. She's the best. I don't know, man. I'm excited about this one. She, is the, she is the best. It's the second to last. It's upsetting. I know. It is a little upsetting. Our, Our avatar journey ends here for the time being. I was going to say for the time being. Yeah. Because we know there's <laughs> lots of stuff coming out. Um, but the last one ended with them, like, Kuvira shooting at them, and then, like, I'm assuming it's going to be, like, I would imagine all-out war at this... Not war, but, you know, like... Well, they're going to get... They're going to take it down, because they just they got, turned yeah. well, Susan. We for, think so. we, yeah, Well, she, really, Kuvira turned them by blasting them. Right, we knew want. that was going to happen, yeah. though. Yeah. I just don't know how they're going to get in to take that thing out. Um, Yeah. What was he supposed to tell him? Oh, like a, a weak point or something like that? No, what? just how to dismantle it or make it like so it doesn't work. Unoperative, yeah. Inoperative. I think that's what they said, but I don't remember. Yeah, I think it was something like that. Yeah, well, it has to be because how else are you going to take that thing down? Right. And I got to imagine, like I said last time, like there's no way it's just going to be like a quiet, like they're going to sneak in, take it out, and then the show's over. You know, I think no there's going to be a some type of battle. Because well, she could still fight like nobody else. And she's not going to just give up once that thing's done. You no know? way. Right. She's so close. I know. <laughs> to what she Republic wants. Republic City is like the last little piece that was given away of the Earth Kingdom that she's trying to reclaim. So she's not stopping. No. They're going to have to kill her. <laughs> There's no way they're killing her. If they didn't kill Zaheer, they're not True. killing her. True. That's for sure. Not in a kid's show. That's <laughs> Maybe. All right, let's watch it. Let's do it. If you guys want to watch the next episode early, go check out our Patreon. We have that there as well as full length. That thing is so big. After Kuvira demonstrated the power of her spirit energy weapon, President Raiko surrendered the city. Avatar refused to give up without a fight. Korra held Avatar Jr. hostage, but the plan failed and she fired on Team Avatar's hideout. Can anything or anyone stop Kuvira and her mecha giant? It's got to be Korra. Day of the Colossus. Maybe that's what they call that thing. That's, I would assume, yeah. Bolin doing Bolin stuff. Go ahead, take your time. Building <laughs> a giant wall. Man, we got a lot of people here. Is that everybody? God. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Better be. Yes. All right, he's good. He's got, got his cape back. <laughs> he looked a little goofy. Yeah. Though. This is my hometown, and I hate to say it, but there's no use risking all our lives to fight that giant thing. Let her take the city for now. We'll think of some way to come back and beat her. What about all the people who haven't been evacuated yet? If Kuvira finds out Wu is with them, she might fire that spirit cannon at him and take them all out. I couldn't stop Kuvira from taking Zhao Fu. I'm not letting her conquer Republic City. Goddamn right. The world isn't safe as long as she has that weapon. I agree. We take down that giant today. Lin! Glad to see you all made it out. You had me worried. Well, you benders are gonna have to. She's a good girl. Standing up high like that. <laughs> best. Not all of them. There are the prototypes. Eating time. Little air support. Sue, you take Batar Jr. and the rest of the wounded back to Asami's office. The rest of us will just have to face Kuvira on our own. Ready? Break. <laughs> on two. On three, pal. <laughs> I forgot she stayed behind with them. Tell that mecha jerk to settle down. She's the one blowing up the whole city. But I just heard on the radio that Kuvira's army has destroyed the train tracks. We're not getting out of the city by rail. Everyone, I was just up on the observation deck and saw a bunch of mecha suit soldiers heading this way. It's over. We're all going to get blown to bits. Listen, everyone, I can get us out of here if you just sit tight. Can you step off the bench, please? It's a little crowded up here. Sure. I'm only the conductor. <laughs> Needs me on the bench. Just stay calm. <laughs> I'll be right back. Come on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? I'm going to get some help. You think you can handle this unruly mob for a little while? I raised Milo. I can handle yeah, anything. That's true. Very true. 
What are you doing, Milo? I just got an idea how to beat the giant. Now everyone, grab some paint. With paint? Find me some balloons. Water balloons filled with paint? <sighs> Throw it at the, the face so they can't see anything? You know what I mean? Maybe. Look at our airbenders. Airbenders approaching. I see them. Distraction. Yep. That's such a devastating noise. And sound. I mean, and, uh, shot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think they are trying to cover up the eye. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's so slow. Swatting them like gnats. Yeah. It is like the Colossal Titan. Look at him go. This is what he meant to do. She has wipers. No. Yes. Metal bend the shit out of that thing. Oh, that's right. Damn it. Yeah, can you melt that thing? Well, I guess it's like indestructible to it somehow. Some big sewing needle thread or spool, <laughs> yeah. Hit it now! Yes. Nice big blast. I was gonna say they should all be doing it. It's like Star Wars, you gotta go for the legs. Cable in. Oh! Jesus Christ. Here we go. Yes, go down. Damn it. Oh boy. How are they all still standing there? Damn it. That was awesome. <laughs> that was the coolest landing. Another happy landing. Oh boy. Everyone retreat. Take the wounded back to Asami's office. I'll meet you there. I'm going to see if I can find help. Just the shrapnel from that alone would yeah. fuck you up. All right, let's fire it up again. Oh, they do have a couple left. Good. I think they said that in the last one. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I love that. Oh, this guy. Kufira's troops are headed this way. I know how to take down some mecha suits, and it just might take down that giant too. 
Same way he did the last ones? Yeah, the EMP. Fired that weapon at me. How could she do that? I don't know, sweetie. She's a complicated person. Wing and Way will never forgive me. <laughs> Wing and Way. Yeah. They might take some time to come around, but we'll work through it as a family. Do you think this plan will actually work, sir? I know I can stop the mecha suits with an electromagnetic pulse. So it stands to reason that I can stop a giant mecha suit with a giant electromagnetic <laughs> yep. pulse. Makes sense. Julie, I've been thinking. <laughs> You're always thinking, sir. Yes, but lately I've been thinking say something nice? about you. I know we might not make it out of this mess, but I feel like there are some things I should tell you. There are? Oh, no. I remember when I was a boy, I, I had an ostrich horse. Named her Mrs. Beaks. I grew up on a farm. Did I ever tell you that, Julie? This was before the circus people took me away. <laughs> anyway, I loved old Mrs. Beaks, but I took her for granted. You'll have to finish your story later. Do I knew where he was going with it. Range. Okay, I hope this works. Nice. Dropping like flies. Not the big one, though. Oh, rats. She's still coming. Julie, do the thing. I'm afraid there are no more things to do. What was that? An electromagnetic pulse. It shut down the mecha suits, but our power source is fine. Locate the source of the pulse. That must be where Varric is. Third and fourth mech platoons, move in and continue the sweep. Capture anyone left in this city. Varric, how come you're Thing you shut down the small mecha suits, but not the big one. Because it's powered with spirit vine energy. I'm sorry. I wish Can Cora do something about it then? You know, Maybe. like with her thing? It's not. Hey. Dad? Dad? Okay. I got him out of jail to help. I figured we need all the geniuses we can get our hands on right now. If the prison's still standing after all this is over, we can throw him back in. <laughs> I don't know what you all must think of me. But I love Republic City. And I would do anything to save her. You think you know how to defeat this thing? You must act like an infection. Break the skin and attack the vital organs. Disconnect the heart and the brain, and this beast cannot live. But mm -hmm. how are we supposed to get inside? Future Industries has plasma saws for cutting platinum. If we had one on the mecha suit... But the saws are way too big. We'd never get the suits off the ground. I think I can add an electrical element to the welding torch on your suit and convert it into a plasma saw. Then we'll just have to land on the giant and cut open a hole big enough for... See, you can do anything. You just need a couple geniuses. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> you know what happens to mosquitoes that land on me? I squash them. We'll have to attack in a swarm. I agree. You guys safe in the hummingbird mosquitoes are the worst. Looks like there are only He's saying that's what they'll do to, the butt, to them. Yeah. Then he ate the <laughs> She's singing to them. little lemur ate up all my trees. <laughs> okay, great job, everybody. Who's got another song for us? We can't just sit around here singing old airbender songs until we're all captured, or worse. Should we play the button game? <laughs> hey, badger moles. Where did these badger moles come from? The zoo. Mako always hated my singing, but they love it. Well, what are we supposed to do with badger? Oh yeah, remember when they were playing the guitar? The big bad badger moles. <laughs> I forgot about that. We can use them to tunnel out of the city without Kavira's troops spotting us. Are you sure this is the best plan? You don't have a choice. Time to go. Badger moles digging holes under Republic City. Gotta run away from the river today. Otherwise, you still think she's pretty. They're so ridiculous. They're I love that top learn from them. Yeah. Because they're blind too, right? I don't remember. I think we found the source of the electromagnetic pulse. Future Industries Tower. That's the place. 
If you do manage to get inside, find the engine room. There were two emergency levers. If you switch them off at the same time, you'll cut the power. Thanks. We may not be able to beat that thing, but we can slow it down. Let's go! Look at this group. Damn. That was good. <laughs> I guess they're saving Avatar State for the finale. Of course. Fight! Nope. Well, she clicks into it every now and then. We, she did it before. We're talking about, like, the real Avatar State, <laughs> you know, like, when she just goes nuts. Ah, that was awesome. I love when they move around with the airbending. And that. And firebending. <laughs> yeah. Right? Firebending, they're just like a jet. I guess they're just trying to keep it at bay for now. Until they can get the yeah. hummingbird thing up. <laughs> the hummingbird thing. Isn't that what they were calling it? I don't remember. Oh shit, that was awesome. This is what Milo's been waiting for. Damn. I saved it. All right, did he get it? I don't think so. He's knocked out? Yep, you're right, he did. Nice. Time to move. Looks like we're gonna have to rebuild Republic City again. They were going to have to anyway. Oh, those bay thongs. Damn. I just threw a building on her. Damn, that was great. You know she's gonna come popping out of there, though. But you're buying a lot of time by doing yeah. that. Not a lot, but... <laughs> 30 seconds. Buying least. some time. Yeah. Look at she loves it. Halt! Turn around slowly and please stop that singing. <laughs> Please stop that singing. Come with us and no one will get hurt. You don't need these people. They're just innocent civilians caught in a crossfire. But I'm Prince Wu, rightful leader of the Earth Kingdom. Take me to Kavira. <laughs> I've got business with her. No, don't do it, Wu. I have to. But before I go, I'd like to sing you a song. <laughs> oh, because they're going to attack. The Badger Moles are going to attack them. You don't respect me. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you know better yep. than a roach. But I'm royalty. They're going to come around. With me. Thank you. No. Actually, your song is so bad, your badger moles deserted you. Not exactly. You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is so bad. <laughs> Those guys are dead. <laughs> he's really coming through, though. Yeah. In his own way. <laughs> they're making him... He's going to be a good leader when he, yeah. when he takes over. If we stop that mecha giant, it will all be because of you. You're the one who designed these incredible suits. It's great to be working together again. I love you, Dad. I love you, too. That's sweet. Also, every time I see a good character wearing those kind of glasses, like Julie's too, how do they stay on their face? You know what I mean? 
I have something I need to attach you, you before we take make off. it like tight here. Yeah, it's gonna hurt though. They won't come off. I need to attach this ring to your finger. Oh, nice. Shit. Will you do the thing for the rest of our lives? Good. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. No, That's me good. neither. Yes. <laughs> About time. These barely functional rust buckets to a giant killer smashing machine. <laughs> That's exactly how I always pictured our engagement. That <laughs> yeah, seems about right. That was cute. I like that. Yeah, that was good. Careful, then. They're going to catch them. Multiple bay fongs, you know it's tough to defend. <laughs> I know. I, I love that look. Speed's out beating power now. Can't she, like, take the hand? <laughs> you know what That's I mean? That's why he went to the part of the back where he can't reach. He's expecting that she can't either. No, see? That's what I was thinking. Cut the arms off. Yeah, can't you go water bend? Freezer? She could probably blast out of it. Yeah, but if you freeze her long enough to get them to cut, you know? Maybe. Nice. Yep. There you go. <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. It's up to Asami. I need more power. They're cutting in. More power. We need to get out of here. Almost there. Oh boy. We have to go now. Almost there. Almost there. Do you think he's gonna eject her and stay? Maybe. Dad, now. Goodbye, Asami. Yep. Love you. I had that thought earlier. Damn it. I hate to say it, but she really squashed him like a bug. Yeah. There's our opening. Like he did mosquito. it, though. He did it. He got the virus in. Well, he's a, he got the hole for the virus to be able to enter right. now. Right. Nice. That was cool. In you go. gonna do now oh what the hell they're going to make you wait till next to the next one well good thing we're watching it next i know damn i was like super invested in that one so I, those are the ones that always catch me off guard that yeah. the endings like that yeah i like that one a lot me too because i we were expecting that to go like i wasn't thinking like i was thinking like oh the sun's just gonna tell them how to do it and they're gonna be able to like sneak yeah in I, forgot, there. I didn't realize i didn't even think they weren't gonna be able to get in and i guess you were right though like where did Iroh and his army go? You know? Uh, yeah. I think they took him out. I think she took him out. There was only a, a, a couple of them. Yeah, because they were, like, right across from each other. Huh. There might be more coming, but... Well, because they had mech suits, too, though, on their side. So I feel like they should still be fighting, you know? Um, Unless she just... I think that's what she did. Maybe, yeah. I think she sunk those boats, so... Well... That wasn't... That's what I'm saying. She sunk the boats, but she... They were all, like, right there. Like, I'm surprised they didn't just start fighting, you know? Yeah. Even if they did have him, he put out that EMP, so... They'd be... 
Well, I mean, like, earlier. Like, how did yeah. they move past them so quick? But I guess, yeah. Because that gun's right. incredible. Exactly. You can't beat it. It is. But I like the way that there are ways of going about, like, just distracting it, you know? Yeah. That's, the only, that's how you have to do those gigantic things. When something's, like, so massive and so strong, you can't go at it straight like straight on. It's, it's it really pointless. sucks, though, that I, I wish it wasn't platinum just so I can see Lynn just metal bend the shit out of it. Yeah, but then it would have been over already. I know. This that's is, why I know it's realistic. Not yeah, because now they're realistic. getting it. Now they're in, so they'll be able to disable it in the next one, and then, the, and then that'll be the fight against Kavira. But I don't think that that's going to even be that good of a fight. I think Cora's going to go into Avatar State and, like, beat I think pretty easily. Eh, I don't think so. I think... I, well, we, we talked about this last one, I think, where I don't think she's going to go into the Avatar State immediately. We hope that she doesn't, but at this point, she's caused so much damage no, and done so does. bad, like, she needs to just kind of do it right away. No, I think she's going to, but she's not going to initially. Like, she's not going to just go into it and then fight her, you know? But maybe I'm wrong. I, I yeah. Well, that's just what she usually does. That's what I'm saying. I, I don't think she should... I think she might do that also, but I don't think she should. And there is, like, I feel like there's different states to when they go into the Avatar state. Like, because, like, she'll, like, flash, like, her eyes will flash, and then she'll do one bending. But, like, then there's the times, like, when they, like, her and Aang, we've seen, like, obviously, like, they they, they glow the eyes, and then all of a sudden, it, they're just, like, unstoppable machines, yeah. and they're bending everything at once. Well, I think it's all it goes to what you're trying to do. Right. right? Like, there she was trying to distract her, so she used it for that. If she was trying it's like to a power attack boost it, in a way. Yeah. then when they when they want when they go f head on and they're attacking in the Avatar state, it's brutal. Right. When they try to keep it defensive, then that's when like they just use things like that. Right. Exactly. But that's what I'm wondering if she's gonna do that. Like. Uh, yeah. That. I could. Yeah. Because I, I I already could see how it's gonna go. It's gonna go like it did last time, where they're gonna be fighting. Korra's gonna do obviously better this time, but then it's gonna get to that point where she's gonna like. Kuvira is going to kind of have to force her to use the Avatar state, and but this time it'll work, like, right. and she'll be able to like prove her wrong yeah. and defeat her. You know, yeah. At least that's the way I would. Kuvira imagine. might even shit talk her, like, for not being able to control the Avatar state. You know, what I mean, it could even go that route. That's what I mean. Like, she'll, right. but like, like oh, even like chirping at it, last it time, and she's yeah. like, oh yeah, well, I'm not the same person I was last time we fought. I would love it though if you were right, and like she just walks in. And, and like they fight for like a her. second, and then like just eyes light up, and then she just puts her in her place. I hope so. Yeah, I do hope so. That would be. And Wu earned his place as <laughs> as king, yeah. man. Wu was like annoying for like the very when he first showed up, like in the show. But then now I'm like starting to find him funny. Yeah, because he's like a good guy. He's not like just being uh, ignorant, not paying right. attention. That's what the the in Avatar. That's like the Earth King. Like he was an idiot, but like he was also like a decent guy. You know. Yeah. Because he, he ended up helping. Uh, yeah, he did. In a way. <laughs> they both did. And I mean, Wu did too. Yeah. Which is funny that he did it with the... Uh, I totally forgot that like, they, they love music and like singing. So like, <laughs> I did too. Badger Moles. <laughs> Remember that guy? <laughs> that was hilarious. Uh, and it's funny. I really... There's... I know it's easy to say this. And the people are probably like, oh, he's full of shit. But like, I actually had the thought of when uh, Varric and Julie got like ejected... Oh, about them getting like, married? No, when they got ejected from the thing, when they when the thing was blowing up. Oh. And they were like, I was thinking in my head, I'm like, I wonder if like Asami's dad's gonna like somehow sacrifice himself. But I was like, but they're in the same thing, so I couldn't figure out how, so I didn't say it. Yeah. And no, you got it in before they did it. Yeah, I guess technically. Yeah. yeah. But it was like right before, so it was like kind of a little more obvious. It was pretty much once they landed on, you started. You're like, oh, one of you, you nailed it. Well, that's because I knew that. Give yourself more credit, pal. That's because I knew that the like. I couldn't put the ejecting seat in like in my head yet <laughs> until I saw Varric do well, it. Well, yeah, we didn't know that they had an ejection seat, which we should have all aircrafts do. Yeah, I really didn't see Varric doing that. No. Uh, posing to that was cool, that. though. I'm I glad he that. did. Me too. Yeah. Because you knew that Julie loved him. Yeah, well, they, you tell they both might have loved each other, you know? You don't he, stick around somebody that long and put up with all that bullshit just because for... Because you're not in love, and I think she knew that too. I like she's like probably just like, oh, he's doing this again. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I know how he really feels about me, but he's like afraid to like show it. Well, so. I think she knew that when he started telling the story before the proposal, when he well, started yeah. telling the story about the the pet that he had that he took advantage of. We knew where he was going with it, and then she realized that too. I didn't. I was glad that he 
did do that. I was nervous for a second that he was going to just keep it as like a normal <laughs> basic story, like no. classic Varric. Yeah, no, I don't think, no. But <laughs> he did it. Yeah, I wasn't sure, though, like like you said, though. Like, I wasn't sure if they were going to have him, like, the two of them get together. Like, right. That, you know, I couldn't really tell. No. But now it's like, I'm trying to think. I, I have a feeling that this will go right to where we left off. Like, they'll be in the thing, and then it's going to pick up. Like, they'll deal with kind of like what Avatar did, but maybe even a little less. But, like, like in their finale, I mean, like, they're going to go into the thing and then they're going to take care of Kuvir and that. And then, like, the last, like, 15... Will be woo and... The last, like, 10, 15 minutes will be his coronation. And then them, like, just, like, settling each character. Like I'm hoping that... Yeah, I'm hoping they show Wu's coronation and then the wedding. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing that. You know, yeah. that'd be cool. <laughs> that would be funny if they show that. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> and if it does like that, then then that could play out where she goes in and kicks the shit out of her quick. Well, I mean, think about it. So if it's, like, a 24-minute episode, 23, whatever it is, right. like... 10, you spend 12 minutes. 15 minutes, or like 10, between 10 and 15 minutes on like that fight. They take the thing down. They get Kuvir locked up or whatever. And then there'll be like a, a jump into like a couple days or a couple weeks later, you know? Right. Yeah. I could be imagining it. Because I think that's kind of what Avatar did, right? Like they, he handled those. Uh, granted, they spread it out over like four episodes, but this was just like the last two or three, so. But like this, like they're now they're going to go into that final battle, which it should be wrapped up pretty quick. Yeah, because she's by herself, and they got all of them. Yeah, right. But you know what's going to happen. They're, it's still going to end up somehow. They're going to, like, they're going to, all of them are going to go down to take the machine out, and she's going to be like, all right, I'll go get deal with Kavir or something, you know? Maybe she's not by herself, because she was saying well, she had a couple needed people. more power. Yeah, yeah so there's got to be a crew in there. Yeah, so what, her and Lynn could probably go and take care of them, but Lynn can go mm-hmm. take care of them. Because who else went in? It was Lynn, Sue, right? Lynn, Sue, Cora, Bolin, Mako? Or Ma- I don't think like we Mako's, saw Mako that Mako entire might time. be with Wu. He wasn't, though. I feel like I didn't see Mako once in that episode. Because they just kept showing Bo Lin. And then Wu even said, like, oh, Mako would be, like, whatever. And Mako definitely was not with him. He said, Mako doesn't like my singing, but I know somebody that does. Was he not in it? Or is he with the president, like, wherever the president is? Could be. I don't know. I don't remember him in that episode now. He's he definitely there. wasn't. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think so either. I'm, if I'm trying to remember where we last we saw him, like he like, separated with he like had a, like a last thing with Wu, and then they s- separated, and then Cora met up with. I don't know. He's definitely gonna be in the finale, though. So oh, of course. Yeah. We'll, hopefully, we'll remember. Yeah. I don't know. Let's get into the next one. Quick. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> anyway, guys, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time. See you later.